Okay, we're going to sing some of the songs about reduce, reuse, and recycle that we sang yesterday. Reduce, reuse, recycle, words that we all know. We have to save our planet so we can live and grow. We might only be children, but we will try, you see, and save this planet. It starts with you and me. Reduce, reuse, recycle, recycle, recycle. Reduce, reuse, recycle, it's easy to do because your world is my world and my world is your world. Reduce, reuse, recycle, it's easy to do. We recycle what we use, separate things and you should too. Glass and paper, plastic, tin, go in your recycling bin. We must start now, we can't wait, quick or it will be too late. And we're also going to sing our Spring Blossom songs. Because if you don't sing it, you won't remember it, will you? I bet you're getting better at it. I have a little pussy, her coat is silver gray. She lives in the meadow, not so far away. She'll always be a pussy, she'll never be a cat. Cause she's a pussy willow. Now what do you think of that? Meow, 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 scat, cat. Here's our cherry blossoms next. The cold winter's past and now comes spring. The newly hatched baby birds cause mother bird to sing. The warm sun comes out, little cherry blossoms are in bloom. Beautiful blossoms will open and smell of sweet perfume. Mmm, I love the smell of cherry blossoms. Oh, I looked out the window and what did I see? Popcorn popping on my apricot tree. Spring had brought me such a nice surprise. Popcorn popping right before my eyes. I can take an armful and make a treat. A popcorn ball that would smell so sweet. It wasn't really so, but it seemed to me. Popcorn popping on my apricot tree. And what's the name of this? Here's your clue. For Sophia. So these words are a little bit bigger and grown up. But you're bigger and grown up now, too. One morning, they unexpectedly burst into bloom and sprouted gold. April used her magic touch and turned a gray day into a surprise celebration for spring. Let me know when you see for Sithy outside. Okay, so here is my story for today. And it's so cute. It's about a little doggy named Biscuit. It says, Biscuit's Earth Day Celebration. That's Biscuit there. It's just a puppy. Wake up, Biscuit. It's Earth Day. Woof, woof. It's beautiful spring day, and we have lots to do. We learned about Earth Day at our school, Biscuit. Today, we're going to have a great celebration. Best of all, you can come along. And he says, woof, woof. Let's get ready to go. So she has to get dressed. She's in her jammies. Woof. On Earth Day, we celebrate ways to take good care of our world, Biscuit. Saving water is one way we can help. See, Biscuit, I must turn off the water when I brush my teeth. I don't want to waste a drop. Woof, woof. Oh, that's good. She learned that at school. We talked about that yesterday. On Earth Day, it's help. It's important to help all creatures, big and small. Woof, woof. Sweet puppy, these twigs are just what the birds need to build a nest. We can leave some bird seed too. Woof. So that's helping the Earth when you help take care of the Earth's animals. Come along, Biscuit. The celebration's about to begin. Woof, woof. 
we're going to plant a garden. We can plant flowers, vegetables, and even trees. Woof, woof. That's the way to dig, Biscuit. Woof. I have a surprise next week we're going to do planting. It'll be fun. So that will help for our Earth Day when we do our planting. With lots of sunshine and water, our seeds will grow and grow and grow. <gasps> Good Biscuit, you found the watering can. Oh, you found a wiggly worm too. Woof, woof. Wiggly worms are good for the earth. This way, Biscuit, it's time for our cleanup walk. We're gonna pick up paper and litter to keep the woods nice and clean. Now, you know what, right now we're not gonna be doing that. And if you ever do pick up things, you need to wear gloves because there's so many germs everywhere. So you can um, get disposable gloves if you ever do go on a garbage hunt. That's what I do. It's good to pick up the garbage, but make sure your hands are, have gloves on and then afterwards you wash your hands. Silly puppy, no tugging. Oh, they're arguing over who's gonna pick up the garbage. Biscuit, what have you found now? What did you find? Did you find a pop bottle in the pond? Woof. Oh no, Biscuit, not a big shake. You got me wet. Woof, woof. Funny puppy, now you're helping keep the pond clean too. So one thing to remember, don't throw garbage. Put it in the garbage can. Look, Biscuit. I decorated a bag, especially for my mom and dad to carry groceries. They can use it again and again. That's called recycling. Can you tell which bag is mine? Did she make this one with, with biscuit? I think so. There's the paints. Woof, woof. This Earth Day celebration is a lot of fun, biscuit. We can sing songs and share snack. Woof, woof. We can learn even more ways to keep our planet safe for everyone. So the teacher's got his little fish saying, don't throw garbage in our pond. That's, where, that's our world where we live. Woof, wait, Biscuit, where are you going now? Oh, look, they're all getting a green ribbon for participating for Earth Day. Hooray, Biscuit. We can be good helpers on Earth Day. Woof, woof, and every day. Woof, and we said every day is Earth Day. We just have to remember, every day is Earth Day. It's up to you. We have to remember, from January to December, every day we make our Earth Day. So now we're gonna go finish our art from yesterday. So, I already started, so you painted it yesterday. So I cut out some of mine already, so I'm gonna finish cutting. This is my recycle, my compost, my garbage, and this is my donate. So you can cut yours out too. I've got a happy face on my donate button. This, this can go in my recycle box because it's paper. And I'm gonna get my glue, put my glue on. it here like that and then I sent this to your moms and dads this week as well so these are pictures of things that you're going to color and then when you're going to sort you're going to decide is it a recycle is it a compost is it garbage or can you donate it so I've already colored some of mine out so let's sort through and see where they should go so this is a newspaper. Where would I put the newspaper? Is it garbage? No, I can recycle it. It goes right there, so I'm gonna glue it on there. Well, here's some papers, just some scrap papers. I can recycle them too. Oh, here's a shirt that doesn't fit me anymore. Oh, I know where that goes. In my donate box. Oh, here's some shoes. My shoes don't fit me anymore. Where can I put them? Do I put them in the garbage? Nope, they, they, they're actually still working okay. If they're working, I would put them in donate, but if they've got holes, I would put them in the garbage. So you have to decide. Here's an old cardboard box. I got that from Amazon. Guess what, it can go and recycle. Oh, here's all the bottles from making dinners, empty bottles. It can go and recycle. I don't have any garbage yet. Oh, I couldn't finish my hamburger. I am too full. Do I throw that in the garbage? Nope, it can go in the composter. What about these bananas? 
I can't eat anymore, I am so full. Do they go in the garbage? No, I can compost them. Even flowers in my garden, when they get old, guess what? Compost. Oh, here's a tin can. What am I gonna do with my tin can? Oh, I can either reuse it or recycle it. These empty bottles, what could I do with these empty bottles? Well, I can recycle. Now here's a book, it's broken, it's got tape, it's got glue. Can I donate it? Would somebody want to look at a broken book? I don't think so. That is garbage. Something that's broken full of tape is garbage. And what about diapers? Well, diapers you have to put in the garbage. They're just stinky. Diapers are going to go in the garbage. So that's what your picture should look like when you're done. And that helps you remember, reduce, reuse, and recycle. So I hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye. Mwah.